Company needs to raise money for capital funding. And we like to do events that are that involve the whole community because our students are from all over Sussex County and so we try to do big events that the whole community and families can come out and have fun and we thought bringing back Dr. Wagner's hot air balloon festival would be a way to do it. I think the biggest difficulty that we had is not so much in the planning of it, it's the actual event because of the wind and balloons are not out and balloons can't go up and we can't control that. And when you have a hot air balloon festival and only have one balloon out on the field, it makes it a little difficult. So we want winds below two to seven miles an hour. If winds are too calm, there's a chance they could get stuck over a patch of woods, over a warehouse, which is in our backyard, back of where we are now. We want winds below seven because balloons don't react fast. By the time you light up this burner, because you want to go higher because you see an obstacle coming, it'll take seven seconds for that balloon for that heat to get to the very top to make that balloon lift. We're also looking at winds in the altitude. We want to see balloons below 20 miles an hour at 3,000 feet or less. Above that, we really don't care. We're not typically going to go above 3,000 feet. I'm just so excited to see so many of our Sussex Academy families out here volunteering and enjoying the festivities after they volunteer. It's great to see them all out outside of school having fun.